Hello everyone, this is Trish from Bird Feed. Welcome back for ideas and inspiration for your Operation Christmas Child shoe boxes. Who out there loves trolls? I know a lot of kids do. They are so funny looking and they're colorful and zany. So I hope the recipient of this shoe box will love them too. This box is for a girl aged five to nine. Recently, I collected a ton of shoe boxes uh, after placing an ad on Nextdoor. So if you like using regular shoe boxes as I do, um, I find that to be one of the best ways to collect them. I got such a huge response. I used to collect shoe boxes at stores and I even had in a department store, a contact person out of the shoe department that was saving shoe boxes for me. But um, that is uh, a lot easier said than done to collect them from a store. This is one of the boxes I collected and it is a great size. It's 13 inches by seven and a half wide, which is the size of a plastic OCC box. Um, it's not quite as deep though. I think this is about uh, a quarter inch shorter, but um, it works great for this Trolls box. Inside the lid, I decorated with the Lenticular Trolls Valentines, a whole sheet of them. Um, I attached it with the double stick tape so that they can remove these easily enough and play with them. These other little decorations are for some from packaging inside the box, um, from items inside the box. And I just, uh, these are attached with spray adhesive. Let me go ahead and show you. This is what she'll see when she opens her box. Um, when she pulls out the backpack, then this is what she'll see. And her backpack is one of them that I got on clearance last year after back to school from Walmart for $1. And I love this pattern. I wish I had, uh, was able to get more of these because they, they work out great for a lot of different themes. The colors on this just reminded me of the trolls in the pink, purple, and turquoise. And... Um, so she's got a full-size backpack and she has a Trolls coloring book of which I got for 10 cents at Dollar General at one point in time when they were clearancing out some of their coloring books. She has a spiral notebook in similar colors, kind of that purple color and her Trolls plush is Branch. Last year I did a Trolls box with Poppy. This one is Branch, and I got Branch last year, I think last August, at Walmart on clearance for $1.50. Then she has a little um, novelty pen this I just recently got at Family Dollar for a quarter. I thought the colors went well for this Trolls box. She has a Trolls shirt. I was able to find this on clearance at Target for $2.99. I thought that was a pretty good price for a licensed shirt. It says World Tour on it. And um, I like this one. It's raglan sleeve. And I think she would enjoy wearing that. It's a medium, size medium, uh, girl's size medium. She has a Trolls hairbrush and bow. This came as a set after Christmas clearance at Walmart last year. And it is a hairbrush and kind of a, uh, like a mylar metallic bow with the poppy in the middle of it and that's poppy as well. So she's got a hairbrush. Um, a purple bouncy ball. This I got for a quarter at 
Old Navy, and those are 49 millimeter. She has a cool pair of glasses that uh, when I saw them, they're not troll sunglasses, but they reminded me of trolls when I uh, looked at them and uh, tried to uh, and decided to put them in this box. These I got, these are uh, Jojo Siwa, as a matter of fact, and I got them on clearance last year at Walmart for one dollar and these are the 100% UV protection sunglasses so um, the trolls are always wearing crazy sunglasses and that's why it reminded me of that. She has uh, a package of trolls crayons to use with her coloring book. She has a fuzzy multicolored change purse that I filled with some hair accessories and a little ring. This reminds me, in, in the pink, it reminds me of Poppy. So I put this one in. It's just a party favor out of a 12 pack from the Dollar Tree. She has two hair elastics with the little decorative balls on them in purple and two lavender colored um, barrettes. And that's all that's in there. And the little change purse I paid 30 cents for at Dollar General a little while back. In this little drawstring bag that I stenciled is, uh, are a few Trolls figures. We have Poppy. I got Poppy last year at the Dollar Tree and Branch. I think the B goes with Poppy. I'm not positive, might go with Branch. And yeah, I think it's the other way around. I think whatever this is goes with Branch, but I'm putting it on Poppy's hand for you guys. And then I picked up Cooper this year, who is really cute. He's got yarn hair and a boom box, although he has no arms, so I'm not sure how he's supposed to hold his boom box. <laughs> I was trying to put it on his ear, but um, yeah, so we've got Cooper. We've got Poppy, Branch, and Cooper in those little figures. And a couple of Trolls lip balms. These I picked up at Walmart after Christmas clearance. And, well, I'm not gonna open them up, but they're shaped like a popsicle, sort of. I don't think the child will make that connection. Um, but I, I also included um, the top of the packaging that said lip balm in it so they'll know that that's what that is and then they'll play around with it to figure out how to open it. You lift the top of the trolls off and then the top cover opens opens up. These were nine cents each so I put both of them in there. A couple of cute lip balms. Hopefully they'll figure that one out. A trolls puzzle, 48 pe piece puzzle from the Dollar Tree and a Trolls wristwatch. I picked this one. I didn't, I, th everybody was hauling uh, $1.50 um, watches left and right. This is the only one I found. <laughs> and it's Trolls. Now, um, it is running right now, but um, just before um, collection week, I'm going to uh, put a new battery in this because I got this last year and um, it's been running for a year, so I want to make sure it has a nice fresh battery in it. So, I have a Trolls watch. Very cute. I thought this little um, bracelet making kit 
went well with this box with the pink pom-pom on it. It has its own like vinyl uh, zippered pouch with satin, multicolored satin cording and letters. Uh, a whole box of, uh, or a package of letters. And this was $1 on clearance at Walmart. She's got uh, a couple of pairs of socks. This is one of them with rainbows on it. I tucked a fun whistle in there. Recently picked these up at the Dollar Tree. Uh, to, uh, to, uh, oh, I forget how many. Six in a package for a dollar, I believe. And I thought that was perfect for the Trolls box since they are very musical. And this is in the shape of a guitar or a violin. Not sure exactly which it is, but I thought that was fun to include in that box. She's got a couple of combs with her hairbrush and a bar of soap. And in the soap container with her soap is a nail, nail clipper and some nail emery boards. Four emery boards are blue on one side and pink on the other, both of which I got on Amazon in bulk. And a toothbrush in pink with the aqua color to coordinate with everything else she's got going on there. A couple of pairs of underwear in a girl's size medium, I think is what they are. Yeah, a Hanes girl size medium. This one has hearts on it in the pink and aqua and the Solid color pair is the same style. Pink with the aqua band. She has a cute clear Trolls uh, pencil pouch. The pencil pouch I purchased on clearance at Walmart for $1.49. And what came in it was a pad of paper, which is on the bottom of the shoe box, uh, a, sh a sheet of stickers also on the bottom of the shoe box, this Trolls eraser, and a couple of pens. I think one's a mechanical pencil and the other is a gel pen. So those came in this um, pencil pouch for $1.49. Then I added eight pencils Four of them number twos, four are decorated. The four number twos I put cap erasers on. She's got an extra Ticonderoga eraser and a um, yellow highlighter. She has a Trolls um, pencil sharpener that I got at the Dollar Tree. And I also added this crazy novelty pencil with the electric guitar on the end, because again, that reminds me of the Trolls. So she's got that for school. She has a nice thick washcloth, a face mask, should she need that in her country, it has the elastic on it, and another pair of crazy socks that remind me of trolls. She has, uh, this is the pad of paper that came in the uh, pencil pouch. And she has a trolls journal that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. It has Poppy on the front and the pages are uh, like an ombre pink with the trolls on the bottom. Let's put that over here. I don't know if you can hear that outside. Someone has decided to start mowing their lawn. She has a couple of sheets of stickers. This uh, sheet of troll stickers is what came inside the pencil pouch. And then I added some Sentos 
stickers I got for three cents uh, after Valentine's Day in hearts and bears and these look like fruits of some sort. And that is it. Oh, here's the um, Trolls Lenticular I put in the box. Um, so hopefully she'll make the connection between this and the ones that I've taped up here so she thinks to peel them off. Hopefully that will work. But uh, that is it, guys. That completes the Girl 5 to 9 Trolls themed shoebox. I hope this one made you smile and gave you some ideas and inspired you to pack a shoebox. Are you doing a Trolls box this year? And if so, what's in it? If you like this one, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching my videos, and I will catch you in my next one. Bye.